And secondly, the existing furnishing of services paragraph is amended by the addition of the words or entity. So the paragraph now reads, the furnishing of services, including consultancy services, by any person through employees or other personnel or entity engaged by the person for such purpose. This should allow the paragraph to apply to the main contractor where there is a subcontracting arrangement, as shown in this diagram. Forco 1, the main contractor, furnishes services through an entity, Forco 2, which is engaged by Forco 1 for that purpose. Therefore, Forco 1 will be deemed to have a PE in Pakistan, in addition to Forco 2, which is currently caught by the paragraph but might be remunerated only on a cost-plus basis.